Good afternoon, good morning, good evening, good everything. What's up everyone? Cascaman back and hopefully I can go ahead and start recording videos now. I've got uh, the extra RAM and I don't know why I'm in fly mode, but I shouldn't be. Um, I'm building a new. I'm going to build a new house here and we're going to start a new series here on the custom 164 mod pack. We have so many mods to go through. I... I I'm <laughs> hopefully I can get around to a few of them, force myself to learn some other stuff, playing with tinkers and things like that, and uh, hopefully learn some new things, and those of you who watch can learn some new things, or get some building ideas, and that's mainly the whole reason why I do all this, is just to build and talk to, and talk about whatever, <laughs> so I decided to pick a spot right up here on the top of a mountain, we are on the west side of town. That's right, west side represent. And um, I'm getting back to the mountains. I and this is a little higher than I like, to be honest. This is 130, 131, 132. So, and I'm pretty sure I will probably shave down a few levels here. Maybe bring it down to 130 or something. But um, you know, I just don't like climbing up all these damn steps. But Oh well, mountain building is the way I like to be. I don't really care for flat land too much, and I feel I can do more, even though I have a smaller space most of the time compared to flat land. But uh, yeah, I, I just like it better. So, and I'm going up and down ladders and steps is annoying as hell. There's no doubt about that, and I probably will complain about it a few times. But uh. Yeah, that's that's all I can say. It's just better. Ow. So I already got some uh, chicken sandwiches here. Got that for free from Spawn, so I'm not gonna have to worry about food right now. I am gonna head off into hmm, the twilight. Yeah, I'm gonna go to twilight, and I'm gonna start collecting some goodies. Get some wood, because this is a highlands area. I think it still says that, yes. Uh, yeah, Highland, there it is. So, I'm going to head off over there. Highlands are not really known for trees and, uh, you know, heavily wooded areas. And then, uh, so I'll get myself started, and then we will come back, and eventually, in a few episodes here, I will show you what is going on with the town here. We got a blacksmith over there. That's my son Drifting's place over there. Um, here we have a railroad barn. Yeah, I forgot. That's the roundhouse and LV's been working on that one. So yeah, there's a lot of good stuff. And There's the, the music player. I hit it on another video. Hopefully you guys watched it and gave it a like. So off. No, that's another. I don't want to go there. Where is it? Here it is. Here's a twilight portal. And away we go. Okay, hopefully I didn't stop recording. It still says it's recording. Yes, okay. So here we are, and I'm just... Ooh, someone set up a quarry over here. I'm just asking for trouble because... I have no tools, no nothing. I wonder who set this up. LV! He's going right underneath the ice. <laughs> nice. Okay. I don't think I can do anything with this rubber wood, but I know I can do something with this. So that's what we're going to start with. And I'm, I don't think I'll show too much of this here. Uh, you know, all of you guys know what's what with the recording. and Or not, not recording. What am I thinking of? Um, you guys know the what's what with all the uh, how to get started and crap like that. So I don't think you guys really care to see all that. But uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to starting new all over again. Wait, I've already done that a couple of times on the server, so people are probably not again. But, uh, yep, I'm going to start all over again. 
and uh, I was building over there near my son. Um, I would say he's not gonna like that I'm moving again because he built his house over there to be next door to me. But uh, you know what? Sorry, bud. You'll get over it. But what do I know? He doesn't watch these videos anyway. As I, he doesn't even subscribe to me. I feel so hurt. I'm gonna cry a little. Nope, okay. So, I'm gonna record a little bit of this here. Actually, no, I mean, I'm gonna stop recording. Yeah, that's what I mean to say. And, uh, I'm gonna get some basics and then I'm gonna head back to the overworld. And, uh, since I've already got the spot to build, I'm gonna try to get some sustain sustainability going. Uh, find some trees to harvest out that way. And if, oh, and for people who have watched me before, yes, I, what is this? Jungle wood, okay. I am using vanilla. Um, I was using the John Smith texture pack, and there's been some computer issues. So, you know, yeah, I'll talk about that really. As I mute myself for a second so I can clear my throat. Okay, all better now. Um, yeah, so I, I upgraded the RAM recently, and I'm running at 16... No, yeah, it's all 1,600 on the speed. And uh, 16 gig total. So I'm thinking, okay, shouldn't have a problem whatsoever. Wrong. Log into the server. I'm skipping all over the place. It's garbage. And... So I had to turn down all the overclock stuff I had going on with the CPU, the graphics, everything. Basically hit the re reset button on that. And that helped it. But it was still, the FPS was just down. Six, you know, running between 15 and, and uh, who was this one? Great wood. Ooh. Oh, there's silver wood. Hmm. That is very tempting. That's a great wood log too. That's a silverwood tree. Awesome. That one's not. Twilight oak. Let's see, I wonder. I. Sorry to get off subject here, but I don't think. Oh, it's regular oak wood. Okay. I don't. I don't remember uh, ever crafting any of that using it before. So, but anyway, the. Um, so it, the FPS was still horrible between 15 and 30. I'm like, I can't record with this. So, uh, got on to Twitch for a little bit, had uh, Red do a lot of help with me on that one. LV gave me a little assistance on some things. So, we were able to clear out a lot of stuff, get rid of a lot of stuff. And, um, yeah, now I can record. I'm recording right now at a solid 50. Um, now I did skip a little bit when I got close to the other guys' house back over there, and I am, I know, on the overworld, and I am a little worried about that, but, uh, hopefully we can fine-tune this a little bit more, and, uh, get it working even better, um, you know, when I don't have it, oh, snap, that is not good, get me out of here, that dude scared the living crap out of me. Go away. Stay away. <laughs> that was a werewolf. And seeing I have no weapons, no tools. Werewolves. Everyone on the server already knows. You need gold swords for them. And uh, everything else is just like, you know, whatever. I heard footsteps. Is that alright? It's alright. I wasn't going to stop hitting that oak tree for a minute because I thought it was just a bear and I'm like, wait a minute. There are no bears in the twilight. But, um, yeah, for those who had, this is the Mo Creatures mod. And, you know, for those who have not seen it or heard of it, and it adds a whole bunch of new creatures to the game. And,. The werewolves that are human during the day and werewolves at night 
are vicious, vicious things. You don't want to fight them unless you have the right tools. And then they got a 30 or 40 on the hits. So, you know, it takes a long time to kill them. Uh, they're just, yeah, stay away from them. If you can, I mean, if you don't have good armor, definitely for sure stay away from them. If you do not have a golden sword, you know, it, it's just bad, bad stuff. They will kill you, and yeah, it sucks. So, I can play Lost Tracker where I was, though, shiny thing, you know? Uh, yeah, so we cleaned up a lot of the stuff, and uh, it is running considerably better right now. I had Optifine in here for all of five minutes, and I remembered why I took it out. Uh, I mean, it sucks that Optifine does not work with this anymore. Optifine, I think, is awesome. Uh, it helps out gameplay so much. But whatever the war is going on right now, Optifine and Tinker's Construct do not agree with each other. They do not play well together. So we've had to resort to Optifine version C6 for 164. And that does not get along well with others, and it screws up the chests. And hold on. Ugh, I had a sneeze building right there. So I was going to mute this and turn off the headset, and <laughs> so I don't blow your eardrums out when I sneeze, but uh... Yeah, the chests don't show up right. They don't show up at all, or they don't have lids. There's other times where the bottoms, they have lids, but they don't have bottoms. And it doesn't matter what chest it is. You know, they all they all show up all screwy. So, you know what? Out with that. And uh, so here I am, playing on vanilla textures with no Optifine. Not too happy. But uh, unfortunately, John Smith just seems to take up too much. Uh, the difference between John Smith and Vanilla Textures was night and day. I mean, there were there was no denying that uh, John Smith hurt, and which is a little surprising because John Smith is not a huge system. I, I mean, I think it is a 32 by 32, if I remember right. So, you know, I would think it wouldn't be too intensive, but apparently it is. So maybe I'll look into some of the lower ones. Uh, you know, the ones that are like 16. I might try another 32. But, uh... My mobs are not showing up. But, uh... Yeah, because I don't know how much longer I can take this vanilla. It really... I mean, I got into the old house, and... I had maple floors, and when I got in there, they weren't maple anymore. <laughs> I'm going to grab some of these. They turn into sticks. So, easy sticks. I don't have to waste wood for them. But, uh, yeah, I turned the maple wood from, like, a almost a grayish color to almost orange. And with the floor setup I had, no, it just didn't, didn't work. So, out with that. So I don't know, if anyone's watching this and they've got ideas on what other texture pack I can run that won't bog down my, my system here, that won't bog down the video, by all means, please go ahead and say something. I'll do my investigating as well and take a look at the different uh, reactions my system has. and. That's why Red and I were both very puzzled by this. It's not like I have, you know, an, a five-year-old computer or, or older. This is, it's a A10-5800 AMD processor, 3.8 gig stand or stock, uh, overclock to 4.2, although my tests had it go up to 4.6, so not too shabby. Um, let's see what else was there. I now have 16 gigs of uh, DDR3. Uh, speed is 1600. I would have liked a little faster, 
but you know, replacing just the 8 gigs alone, not something wise for me to do on a tight budget right here at Christmas anyway. So my girlfriend talked some smarts into me and I just picked up another two sticks of 1600 and you know, it, it's helped. Uh, it undoubtedly has helped, but I know going up to 1866 or 2133 will also help. Um, Unfortunately, with that, uh, you also raise the latency. And for those who don't understand RAM, um, the speed is how fast it gets in, you know, in information in and out. I believe it was, and the latency is how fast it recognizes that information or, or processes or whatever. So. Um, you know, where the 1600 or the 2133 is faster than the 1600 uh, because it's, you know, it can get that speed in and out and whatnot. Uh, the latencies on them kind of hurt it. So, because with latency, you want the lower the number, the better. But, and I probably just screwed all that up and someone's going to casket, you had it wrong, it's not right. And that's all fine, you know, go ahead and correct me, but. I probably did get it wrong, but I, I, in the end, I know what I'm talking about, and I know what I need, what I'm looking at, and, uh, how much sticks is that, 37, um, 1600 with an A10 processor here, not the best choice, uh, I'm actually holding back the processor, uh, this processor is hungry, and, if anyone has ever seen Jeff Dunham and one of the clips where he's got Peanut and they're talking about the deaf people and the sign language guy and how Peanut was screwing with them, uh, you know, it, it's like the processor is sitting there, go, you know, sitting there going, "Come on, give me more." He's waving his hands, you know, "Give me more, give me more," and well, the RAM can't because uh, it doesn't. Yeah, I'm gonna grab some of this too. Uh, it, you know, it can't get all the information through it fast enough. So, you know, having the extra eight gigs in here does help. Uh, that I already knew, but uh, still, the speed is hurting it. And the benchmark I looked at for this A10, uh, 2133 was the highest they could go. Turns out the board that they had uh, was not compatible with, uh, see, I don't know if I want this stuff or not, was not compatible with 2400. So they were not able to test that. Ah, Birchwood. Okay, yeah, I'll take that. But, um, right now, 1600 will have to do. And here I am recording. So, what else do I have here? I also have a, uh, Radeon if that's how you pronounce it, I don't know, I'm horrible at that stuff. It's a 7770, so it's only one gig DDR5, but it's not like I need something hugely big for this game. Uh, it might help with recording, it might not, but, uh, you know, it, basically the system I have set up right now works. You know, even Red said, he says, there is no reason, as we go back, See, that worries me. Zero, two, four. Now we're back up. This rain is killing me a little bit. But, uh... <coughs> the, uh... He even said himself, he says, You've got a good setup. It should... This game should be moving smoothly. I think my admin responsibilities are going to be needed. Right, let me go back to this house. It's safe, it's dark out, something will be up on that mountain, and it will eat me up. What is with the lightning? This is something that I believe Elby set up. And, uh, just a little decoration house. I'm not going to call it home, but, uh, 
and chop all this up. Put that back over there. We got sticks, so... Need to start off with a pickaxe. Need to start off with a sword. Do, do, do. I don't, probably didn't even need that. All I really need is a pickaxe. So, okay. Let's go get... Um... Oh, if anyone on the server is watching this and they wonder what these are about, they're meteors. They're me yeah, it hit right around here. Usually leaves yeah, they probably hit right here, and this is a meteor. They've been crashing like crazy around here. It's like every day you can go within a certain radius of your house and find a block that came down. I don't think. Is hit anyone's house yet? Uh, I have not heard anyone say that. Although I, you know, I could have missed it, but uh, I don't know what they're talking about now. I haven't been paying attention, but uh, that's where they come from. It sounds like a large explosion, and then you go outside and you'll see that. So, if anyone's on the server watching this, that's where it came from. Don't worry. I don't think anyone's ever been hit by one, so you don't have to worry about that. Alright, so there we go, and the sun's coming up. I am going to cheat and get rid of this weather. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. I'm not the brightest bulb in the box, am I? <laughs> I just climbed all the way back up here. You know what? Screw it. I'm going to keep that. Uh, give me the oak. Here it is. Now, I like getting another different station, a different crafting table out of it. I like the crafting stations better. <clears throat> Sorry if you can hear me. I'm drinking my Mountain Dew. Because um, you can leave stuff in there. See? Still in there. Doesn't fall out. That's why I like them. They're awesome. I don't think I will use a regular crafting table again. So I'm going to put this one over here. And I'm just going to stuff this stuff in there. I'm going to bring a couple of these with because I need to go out and get a boatload of stone. I should break this and bring you with. Now, I know about that other thing. What is, yeah, this one. I know about this, but although I've crafted stuff in there, I've never been able to pull it out. Granted, I haven't really looked into the information about it, so of course I know nothing. But, um, yeah. <laughs> Can't really use it if I don't know how to use it. Let's see, can I get around that coal over there? Uh, yeah, I think so. Drop down here and over here. Okay, so what is the plan here for me on this? I think this is just going to be a straight up regular large mansion mountaintop house. That's it. Now, LV wants a medieval theme, and I'm, yeah, that's fine. I'm okay with that. But, uh, you know, that, that's, uh, hell, that's usually all I build anyway. I'm not one of those guys that's going to, oh, I want modern, or I want abstract, or something like that, you know? I just build what I think looks good and what I feel like building. And, uh, I try to make it spacious. I'm not one to, uh, make really tight, cramped confines. That's not me. Um, I also try to plan ahead, too. And so what I'm probably going to do in this build here is build the house first. And then I will move over and, uh, start building the bulk of my processing stuff. You know, I'll probably do the Tinker's Construct and uh, 
you know, get basic pulverizer and furnace and things like that going. Because uh, even at this stage right now, I hate wasting metals. Or I hate wasting ores. I really, really hate doing that. So, you know, I'll hang on to all my stuff. Until I finally get enough quartz. What do we got over here? We have a block in the middle of air. I hate this. It drives me up a damn wall. What have we got down here? Someone's been in here. Okay. See, I'm gonna go that route. I think Elvi did that too, cause you know I re I who likes building their house and then uh, or who likes you know having to dismantle half their place just to do stuff. And that's quite possibly what I'll have to do here, which I will find completely annoying. But. Uh, that's the way it goes though sometimes. You add stuff in and you continue building around it and then you realize you need to build something else. And, you know, pain in the butt as it is. Ooh, wait, I also forgot. That is not enough. Smooth move, dude. Now you got no wood. Well, which way do I want to go here? Hey. Oh wait, what do I have as waypoints? I forgot. I have set some waypoints. Willow wood, redwood. Ooh, I will have to go and get the redwood. Not yet. Get rid of that. Okay. I'm going to start off this way first. Uh, unfortunately, I don't feel like I got a lot done on this first episode, because we're coming up to the 27 minute mark. If this thing recorded anyway, you know, with the, 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 what am I thinking of? The frame rate drop, uh, action here is known, in my past anyway, to, uh, stop recording. Although it still shows it is recording, so... Hopefully, it did not screw me over like that. Um, only time will tell, and this thing's about to break, and I still don't have any wood or sticks. So, I think that will be a perfect time to go. There it goes, alright. Sounds like a perfect time to go ahead and call it a day on this one. So, I will get some more mining done here, and... Then I will come back and do another episode. And hopefully I have some work done for you guys. See, there's another frame. Yeah, that spike right there. That in the past was known to trigger action to stop recording. Although it still says it is recording. So, and, uh, oh yeah, I need to get freaking stairs built. This will drive me up a freaking wall. But, uh, hopefully that did not happen this time. And I can continue where I left off, and we can all be happy, happy, happy. So, for now, I am out of here, people. Bye-bye.